Hey guys, my name is William. In today's video, we're going to be going over a tool that destroys Google algorithm. That's right, a tool that destroys Google's algorithm. Kaboom, baby! All right, without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Number one tool you need to be using in SEO. Take a guess. Your brain, not a tool. Most people neglect it. They don't test things. They want to ask everybody, well, how can I do this and how can I do that and not actually get in the trenches and test it. There are lots of people that are out there talking about SEO that aren't actually in the trenches doing it. Okay. No, I don't really want to do it. So number one, use your brain, learn SEO, local e-commerce, whatever you want to do and actually use your brain, test, test, test. Number two, my favorite, Google Insights. One of my favorites, right? So Google Insights gives us a lot of really cool stuff that I really, 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 really like. Oh, really? It's like, for instance, if we went here and we looked at this, everybody sees Insights, or oh, it's cool, over left-hand side, you hit Insights. But what this tells me, like right here, right? If I was to zone in on this, I would see, let's say, all these different areas where he's getting calls from, right? And the lighter areas, if you will, like Plano, and he's wanting to get more calls from Plano, or let's say he's wanting to get more calls from Garland or Misquit. What I would start doing is writing content, press releases, blog articles, my content on my GMB posts to be associated with those areas and then making landing pages associated with those specific areas. Maybe condos, maybe apartments, maybe hotels, maybe restaurants, etc. that are in that specific area. Wow. Yeah. You may be like, well, William, how can I find, you know, what to do in Mesquite or Garland? Well, let's go over to our handy dandy little friend called Google. That's another one of my favorite tools. Huh? What? You know, go things to do Garland. And besides the fact that I already have a plugin that does this for me, best things to do in Garland. And Google literally tells you everything to do in Garland. Nothing at all. And then associate all this information on that specific landing page for Garland. All right. Next favorite tool is going to be Google Trends. Google Trends. What is Google Trends? I don't know. Please don't ask me that. Google Trends basically tells me what is trending. If you've never looked at it, for example, Google Trends, I'm just doing some research, but let's say I wanted to look at a term, let's call it a um, emergency tree remover, right? or something like that. This will tell me if it's gonna be a good topic to get into. Hey, that looks pretty good. You know, is it trending down or is it trending up? Let's look at a roofer or roofing. And this will tell me, it will literally break down the keywords. It tells me the topics people are interested in, like this asphalt shingle, okay? What cities, what are the top cities? What are cities that aren't even being touched right now? right is this a good niche maybe to do a rank and rent in or rank for leads you know you get a gmb get it ranking get it producing leads and then make money pay me my money Let's say orlando and it just shows me the information so basically google trends shows me exactly what i need to know home repair oh that's a great topic metal roof here's another one and then it breaks it down into the different areas so i know right off the bat what are the areas i could probably break into right what are the topics galvanization leaking cutting nails pergola all the stuff that's giving me all the content my areas my locations everything so you could do your due diligence this way most people immediately want to go to a tool that they think is going to get them ranked or destroy the algorithm. Number one tool is going to be your brain. Number two is Google Insights, especially for local. 
And number three is Google Trends. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> I hope you liked the topic today. If you would like, I actually have a standard operating procedure on doing due diligence to help destroy Google's algorithm. Make sure to comment below in the comments and say, give me the standard operating procedure. Give me your spreadsheet, William, or something like that, and I will email it over to you and I will message you personally. Once again, my name is William, and in today's video, we went over how to destroy Google's algorithm. You guys be blessed, and I will see you again. I have so many SEOs that hate me and say that I'm still in their methods. They bitching and cry, labeling me SEO Black Cat. I was a nobody, now I'm at the top. Most wanted, most loved, bad business owners, and hated by most SEO opponents. You think you're an SEO god, but you're an SEO fraud. Guess I'm the SEO devil, shout fuck the SEO guys. White hat SEO doesn't make sense, going with the goody goodies. Up in heaven dressed in white, I like black tins, I like black hoodies. Fake SEOs up there, probably have me on some real straight shit. No sleeping all day, no getting my dick licked. Hanging out with the goody two shoes, lounging in paradise, whole shit. Fuck that 